We want to make sure that it, anyone that wants their voice heard gets heard. Well, we are your local election headquarters. The polls are set to close soon as voters decide on local city council members and state propositions. Good evening, I'm Carson Bush Jost. And I'm Madeline Bierster. ABC Big 2's Avi Cargloss joins us live at the Midland County Annex where voting is still ongoing. And Avi, you spoke to a county elections official today. Yeah, an elections official told me how easy it is to vote in Midland County today. You can go to one of the 12 polling locations around the county where officials are expecting a steady flow of voters. In an off-year election like 2021, voter turnout isn't expected to be as high. However, Midland County elections officials expect the local community to brave the mild precipitation and chilly weather to make their voices heard. The constitutional amendments, the city races, the uh, county assistance district, the Greenwood uh, bond issue, I think those are all things that are important to the uh, people of Midland County and I think that they're going to get out and vote. The wait times depend on where you vote and what time you get there. Earlier this afternoon at the Annex, voters told me they were in there for anywhere between 15 to 30 minutes. It went pretty fast. Uh, the line was long, but it went a lot faster than at the DMV. <laughs> kind of slow, but uh, it was ex to be expected on election day instead of voting early. While there's no potential president or governor on the ballot today, there is an opportunity for people to choose who and what they think will improve their community. Local elections, that's where you live. You want to know who is making the decisions that affect your everyday lives. The people that we want to win, are they actually doing what we want them to do? Are the propositions, Are they? how are they going to affect me? Do I like that? Do I not? So it's your local government and it's your tax dollars you'll be spending there. Uh, and it's our, our duty. And the voting locations close tonight at 7 p.m., so there's just a little bit more time for you to cast in your ballot. Reporting live in Midland, Avi Cargloth, ABC Big 2 News.